Well, it's uh, Tuesday, about uh, five minutes to 11. You can see it's not raining, but it's awful gray in a lot of places. I guess we're going to the land of Nana about two o'clock. I think low tide's at 437. I've been out and about this morning, picking up some stuff and doing some stuff. I picked up some knives. One of them's that shun right there. I want to show you a bad looking shun. That thing has got in major chips. You won't believe it. But the coolest thing is my lucky day. Look at this. I hope you can see that. That's a miniature rowboat. My buddy that went with us the other day, Eddie Fisher, he, uh, he's a very talented guy. Talented in many, many ways. And he's got all kinds of cool things made out of wood, metal. I mean, he can do most anything he wants. He got a shop that people would die for. He's got some paddle, he made a paddle boat, almost just like the one I showed you the picture of for his grandkids. He's got a pedal uh, aircraft like the Red Baron used to fly, except it's yellow. And he's got a P-38 pedal plane. When you turn the pedals going down the street, the propeller turns around. I meant to take a picture of it and I completely forgot. But I can get them from him. He can send me some and I'll show you to him. But anyway, that skip is really nice. I'll show you a better picture when I get home. What else I got to show you? Uh, be, uh, Mumbles Man. He's become a dry sand hunter all of a sudden. I don't know. He went this morning to crack of dawn, like 5 a.m. to land on Nada. And uh, it's unbelievable. He, he didn't find any tickets, but he dug a lot of stuff. A lot of bottle caps. I mean, a lot of bottle caps. That Knox likes them bottle caps. I'll show you the picture, you know, at the end like I normally do. And he's going to go with us this afternoon, so it'll just be me and him. And uh, I think Low Tide Tim may even go with us today. And maybe the Guru. The Guru was charging to go yesterday. But, like I showed you... We would have got run off the beach anyway, so it's just as well we didn't go. Well, I'll get back to you in a few minutes. All right, here's that skiff that Eddie made. It's in a little stand it sits in, see? It's a replica of a crab skiff. Flat bottom, Chesapeake Bay type crab skiff. Got a little oars in it. With the straight up type row, rower locks, oar locks. This thing is cool, ain't it? Look at that. Mm. I just got to clear off a place on the mantle to put it in. I'll put it on, I mean. I like it. He's got all kinds of things in his house. It's just amazing. I should play that number on the lotto today. Look at that, 9827. That's my daughter's birthday, the 27th. The 98 don't do much for me. But I'll play it this afternoon if I can think about it. 9827. That's a good number. Where were we? Oh, I know where we were. Knives, kitchen knives. From that guy, the chef at the Gourmet Gang. It's a place in it near the airport and make sandwiches and, and food for the airlines. Put this up here. This is that shun I was telling you about. That's poor baby. Look at the chips along the blade of it. Can you believe it? He was cutting some frozen chicken. I think the chicken won. $300 knife. I think I'm going to charge him $15 to fix it. 12 to sharpen it and 3 to take the chips out. Maybe 18 I haven't decided yet. It's no big deal though. It just looks bad right now. 
I'll show it to you tomorrow. Or maybe later today. I got us uh, It's only 11.43. We're not going to Atlanta not until uh, 2. If the weather doesn't get us. But we just got a severe weather alert on our phones. For bad weather. Again. That way. You see it coming from the North Carolina side. See them big old clouds over there? We're in for something. They're getting pounded down there now. I just don't know how fast it's going to get to us. Damn, I see some figs from here. I got to go outside. Rain fattens them right up. Then the birds and bees take over. There's one right there. It needs about another day or so. And that one too. Oh, let's see here. That one there is okay. That one's okay. Good snack. Right off the tree. Somebody had a good snack. That's a good snack for me. Pigs, they're everywhere. I'm trying to find one with the June bugs, I call them. Big green beetles. They get on them, man, they cover them up. They, don't, they can't even, they fight for space. Stand by. Look at this four or five big old June bugs. Oh, he's gone now. June bug. Oh no, he's, uh, he's still there. You see him? But usually it's three or four of them on one little fig. Type feasting away like I'm doing. I guess they're honeybees. They don't bother us. There's a lot of them around. Too much rain. All right, that's enough figs. And more rain coming. This is a gig master's video from Sunday. He just put it up. You want to see some fine stuff? Take a look at that. The gig master. He found that silver. Five rings. He found a, I think he said 18 karat gold chain with a little heart thing on it. For a guy who lost it. He found the chain and then he found the pendant later. That's pretty good hunting right there when you can find both of them. I don't know if he's in the water or not. I haven't watched the video yet. It just popped up. Gig Master. Check him out. Our buddy Steve Street and his wife, they went to, uh, I'm not sure where they were, Hampton maybe. He dug a little, I think he said, uh, I don't know if he said, I forgot what kind of ring it was. I know it was gold and lots of gray matter. See if I can find his thing here. Hold on a minute. To the soil. But he, he, her husband found a little gold ring with both of them using knock 600s. And then we have, uh, this is a guy from England, the Beach Badger. He found a gold ring, a silver, two cup silver coins and lots of gray matter. I don't know where he hunts in England, but somewhere in England. The Beach Badger, check him out too. He got some cool, he hunts in some rough territory though, I tell you that. Good gracious, you won't believe it. 
All right, that's enough ranting for the last 40 minutes. I'll get back to you when we head to the land of Nala. Well, I got a truck full of looters. Guru, Momo's man, and Low Tide Tim. Everybody's going to the Excal. They throwed all the Noxes in the trash can. Damn. I already knew that. Um, how you doing today? Hello. Having any luck? Huh? Garbage. Two dry sanders. There ain't many depositors today. The rain is uh, running my home, I guess. But it's Tuesday, too. Stand by. The waves are angry today. I don't see any walking in the water much. But the tide's not low for two and a half hours. So maybe when the tide gets off, it'll get a little better. Hello. Damn. All right, let's go. Well, a half a buck. I've dug a penny and a dime. One half a block. Well, we got our first decent sound. Whatever it was, must have been little. It's not there anymore. It's gone. Damn, I'd like to know what that was. That sounded good. Not to be had. Oh, well, there it is. I didn't think it was that little thing, gray thing there, but there it is right there. Ain't much happening. Uh, the other night, I thought... Who's making out? Uh, I think everybody put their pennies in here today. I got, I ain't got but three, but I got three dimes. Denny's got some pennies. I got like five or six and one dime. It's a nice sound. See if we can get it. Might have been a floater too. It's gone now. God. That was a nice sound right there. Probably a piece of aluminum, I guess. Now, there's a quarter, sounds like. Big, really loud. I told you it's big crap. Look at that. Aluminum. Equinox's favorite target.
Tough going, eh? Sounding sound too. Ah! I don't like it when things happen like that. There's somebody in front of me, I can't tell who it is. Might be Glenn. I'm not kidding you, 100%. Three, three, that's four pills right there. You'd have to take four at one time. <laughs> and I don't mean Viagra either. I mean nitro. Nitro pills. Coconut. Imagine. I'm under the pier now taking a break. You got some nice rings on and a nice bracelet. You ought to leave them in the room. I might find them tomorrow. Yeah, I'm not much for going too far out though. <laughs> as soon as I feel something on my foot, I kind of get squirmish. There you go. I'm a Yankee. What are you girls yeah. drinking in that thing right there? It looks pretty tasty. It had a smoothie in it. Really? It was Get really it good. Here. Yeah, it, what, where was it? No, it, it's right off the street. 16th Street. Uh, alcoholic or just a smoothie? No, you probably can get alcohol in it. It smells good. But I smell the way over there. Take it easy. Yeah, yeah. Run up with Tim on the other side of the pier here. He's digging something right now. Let's see what he's got. I see somebody else down there in an orange shirt swinging. I see two orange shirts down there. Damn, I thought I seen three of you. Damn. I thought I seen three of you, them orange, them yellow shirts. Yeah, I saw it. It's Gig Master. Oh. We're in Gig Master territory now. Yeah. I got some guys. Turn around and be back.
kind of bad sound here. Maybe a nickel or a piece of aluminum or something. like a piece of copper now. The Equinox's favorite target down here. Copper. We're going back into the northern territory now, out of gig masses zone. It's a bleak day in the land of the Nada. Unless things change on our way home. A bleak day. In some respects. The tide's starting to get off good. I thought I found something, but it's gone now. But it was a nice sound for a minute, dude. How you doing today? No kind of tickets. Unless I got a parking ticket when I get back and they the only thing. <laughs> hey, nothing happened, buddy. Well, we're on a ball spot today. God knows. Vic said he didn't have nothing. No. We're getting spanked. Oh, not a spanking us today. Who, Kenny? Yeah, I figured he would be. Taking a break, huh? Huh? Taking a break. <laughs> Let's go. All right. That's what we should be doing. Sitting down, taking it easy in the recliner at home. Come on, go real, get up. Damn, oh, hold on a minute. Might be some nitros right here by him. Maybe that's why he's sitting there. Get his blood pressure back up. Yeah, I suspect so. Come on, come on. I'll be in a minute. <laughs> come on. the girls today. That's a nice looking taquito. Buffalo roll taquito. That's all. Just girls. No treasure. Starfish, I think the ends have broke off. From the last night it looks like. There's a pirate ship. In one word, spanked. That's what Nada did to us today. The Mumbles man had six more dimes than me. And I think I had one more quarter. Isn't that exciting? exciting?
as far as I know, everybody you saw in this video was spanked. I don't know about the gig master or the guy that we saw deep out in the world because I don't know who he was or what they had. But I know the rest of us were spanked. That's the way our old buddy Nada does to us sometimes. That's why I call it Nada, the land of Nada, for that reason right here. <laughs> it was a bad day in Black Rock today. See you tomorrow. I got two damn knife gigs back to back, Wednesday and Thursday. Good luck to everybody.